The Falcon and the Winter Soldier Episode 4 is now out on Disney Plus. And I'll tell you what, this is the best episode by far. So I'm going to tell you guys exactly how I felt about this episode. But before that, let me know in the comments below what did you guys think of episode 4. Was it your favourite? Was it not? I want to know. Smash it down in the comments below. Hit that like button as well while you're down there. Click subscribe. And let's jump into this review of episode Episode 4 of The Falcon and the Winter Soldier has now officially hit Disney Plus. I watched it and I loved it. It's my favourite episode so far. Boy, there is so much to unpack in this episode. We are going to go into heavy spoilers in this uh, video. So make sure you have seen the episode before you come and join in the discussion. Because there will be spoilers in the, in the uh, comments below. But, if you don't care and you're not worried, then stay along. Smash that like button as well. We're going to go into it because you've been warned now. Spoilers alert. Now... We start off where we picked off straight from the last episode and we actually get to see a bit more of a little bit of a relationship between Bucky and the Wakanda soldier. Um, I forget what their name's called. The um, I'm blanking on it. I'm blanking on it. Anyway, and we see a little bit of how they were able to, we see Bucky finally break free of the mind control and they're doing that in Wakanda. So I thought that was a pretty cool thing. But... We see them and they give him a timeline that so then they go back to Baron Zemo and Falcon and we start to see them looking for our villain, the Flag Smashers. We're looking for Carly. Can we find Carly? And that is their goal for this episode, is trying to find that particular person. They start, you know, start to find certain things. Zemo is cunning as normal. Absolutely brilliant. I mean, he is just such a cool character. And he's so cunning in this episode that he's just... Oh. But you do learn a little bit more about him as well. Anyway, we still continue on this journey trying to find Carly. They do find Carly. However, fake Cap US agent is there as well. Walker's there with Battlestar. They're both there. And Sam's like, I'm going to go talk to her. So, you just need to chill out here. I'm going to go talk to her and try and solve this peacefully. So, Sam goes in and they have a great exchange. Him and Carly have a great exchange at the funeral. And they're trying to... Sam's trying to get her to just lay down and like... We can change this and we can do it the right way. We don't have to kill innocent people to get what we want. And then, of course, Walker just... I, he, he's at the point where he's just... He's getting fed up and he just storms in... And a big battle breaks out. Uh, yeah, and it's just all hell breaks loose. All hell breaks loose. And now Sam and Buck and all that are just like, Yo, bro, what are you doing? You just cost us the chance to stop this from happening. Anyway, then we fast forward and move on. And <laughs> the, I, they're called the Dolmelage or something like that. I'm pretty sure they go. They appear as well. Back, they will appear back in this as well. We will get to that. But then we, um, what's it called? Wait, does that happen beforehand? I totally forgot. I think that, anyway, so when, when all the fight happens, Carly escapes and runs into Baron Zemo, and Zemo shoots her. She spills all the serum, and he smashes all the serum. And you can clearly see he doesn't want super soldiers, he wants them completely erased. Gone from existence. So he destroys all them. She runs off. She's now got to regroup again. Meanwhile, Walker knocks out Zemo and takes one that hasn't been broken. One of the serums. He takes it, puts it in his pocket, and we're like, ooh. He's going to take it. He's going to take it. And it's very hinted, very like, very hinted. It is hinted towards in the episode that he did take the serum in the end. Anyway, he gets his ass beaten by the Dormelage. Zemo gets out and escapes. Then Carly calls Sam's sister and wants to set up a meeting. They're setting up a meeting. She reveals she wants to kill Captain America, fake Captain America, that is, in front of everyone to really send a statement out to the world. Meanwhile, 
And they captured Battlestar. I just love saying Battlestar. They captured Battlestar. And Walker is on the move to save him and that. Sam and Bucky are there. They're fighting off. And Sam realizes that uh, Walker's taking it. You can tell because he's beating up these super soldiers. Anyway, so they get there. And they're having a big fight with the super soldiers. Carly comes in to kill him. Battlestar comes in and tackles her. And she throws Battlestar into the pillar. Killing him. He's there dead. Walker sees this. Walker goes over to check if he's there. And I tell you what. Walker snaps. The guy just snaps. He jumps out the window. And he gets this. Gets uh, I think it's Carly's right hand man. Up against thing. The world is watching. There's videos. Everything is happening. People surrounded everywhere. And he's asking where is she? Where is she? And you can see the pain in his eyes. The way that he is struggling. And he just murders this guy in front of everyone. It pans up and he's just looking and you can just see the pain, the everything about what's going on with his character in his eyes. And it was brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. And then, it's, and then it cuts. Absolutely brilliant. I thought we got a little bit more of development of Bucky and that. We got a bit more development of Carly as well. And fake Cap Walker, we really got to see his character broken now. What now? He has the serum. And now, he has, um, what's it called? He's killed someone in front of everyone. Everyone's seen it. What is going to be the consequences? That's the question moving to the next episode. What are the consequences now? Who is the power broker? What, where did Zemo go? What is the role going to play now? we got two episodes left. And boy, it's heating up now. I cannot wait till these next two episodes. What's going to happen? I enjoyed it. The action was great. I thought... The use of the Wakandan soldiers was great. I thought Zemo's role was great. Walker's character turn, turning heel, is coming. And it looks like it's going to be incredible as well. I cannot wait. So let me know in the comments below. What did you guys think of episode 4? Did you love it? Did you hate it? I enjoyed every single bit of it. I thought the pacing was great. It looked beautiful. Everything about this was brilliant. Let me know in the comments below. Smash that like button. Hit subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.